denominator. Suppose you are given a denominator or a fraction which reads as 1 divided by under root 5 minus under root 7 and you are asked to rationalize it. As I told you in the earlier video, you know, whenever you are given any kind of a denominator, you need to see what is the pattern of that denominator and does it match with one of the identities that we had discussed earlier. Because if there is an identity with which this matches and you can recall that, then in that case it becomes easier for you. So if I look at this, you know, there's another identity, if you remember, we had discussed that under root x plus under root y when multiplied by under root x minus under root y, it is equal to x minus y. Now, if I pose this vis-a-vis -vis this, what I see is that I have a matching of under root x minus y over here, right? The only thing I need to do is, I need to multiply this fraction or this denominator by under root x plus y and that will give me something which doesn't contains any square root or irrational numbers. So, but the fact of the life is, I can't do some multiplication in isolation. So, I multiply this by 1 or if you want to replace this, I can also replace 1 by what? By under root 5 plus under root 7 divided by under root 5 plus under root 7. This is also equal to 1 only. Now here if I see, I have got a parenthesis which is matching with this. x minus y, x minus y, x plus y x plus y. And if these two are to be multiplied, suppose 1 into this will just be very simple, under root 5 plus under root 7. This is similar to this. So this will give me 5 minus 7 or minus under root 5 plus under root 7 divided by 2. 5 minus 7 is minus 2, so you can two, take 2 here and take minus as the cool sign. So again, by doing this, I have rationalized the denominator. Again, just at the cost of repetition, just at the cost of repetition, the solution lies in identifying which of the identities we had discussed earlier match with the denominator. Once you have done that, then it becomes fairly easy to rationalize this.